okay next question voice modulation i think it's the most important whatever you are discussing with the panelists whatever answers you're giving it's your voice that is doing if not more than 90% of the job your voice and your facial expressions because you cannot move your hands a lot you have to keep the movement to a minimal you cannot stand and move a lot so you cannot aggressively do anything with your body it's your facial expressions and it's your voice modulation or the way you're saying whatever you're saying that matters okay make sure that there is enough voice modulation in whatever you're saying but there is not too much voice modulation that's also bad not too much and you would know when it's not too much if you look like an actor if you sound like an actor that means it's too much uh, but make sure that there is voice modulation you are stressing on the right keywords okay just observe for the next 2 minutes whatever i'm saying or go back in time pause the video go back and start the video again and just observe the voice modulation that i am doing i'm trying to stress on the right keywords i'm trying to modulate my voice up and down up and down okay so that's how you practice it you have to practice it regularly when you stress it uh, on the right words when you use the right keywords when you modulate enough when you give the pauses at the right place that's very important not only giving a pause but giving a pause at the right place when you start doing those things automatically the impact of whatever you're saying increases okay by leaps and bounds it it does not increase uh, marginally it increases substantially and these things make a big difference in your impression on the interviewer so make sure that you're not boring you're not sounding boring you're sounding interesting and you're using the right voice modulation 